In this video, we're looking at the issue of calculating the size of the subsidy. And to do this, we're looking at a question from the 2012 HSC, which has been reproduced from uh, Nessa stroke Bostis, um, the Board of Studies. So if we look at the question, it's all about subsidies, beach towels, all these sorts of things. The question says, what is the subsidy per towel paid to domestic producers? So before we get into the meat of the question, let's think about it this way. So the size of a subsidy is the vertical distance between the supply curves. Okay, so it's this vertical distance in terms of calculating the size of a subsidy. So let's do this using an example. We know from the question that the equilibrium price of beach towels with the subsidy is $10 per towel. Okay, so we know here that this is the price with the subsidy. So let me tell you how I calculate these types of questions. What I'm looking for is the vertical distance between these two curves. That will give me the size of the subsidy. So what I do is I pick a quantity. Okay, so let's say 12. So let's say step one, pick a quantity. So I say 12. So then what I do is I go up the quantity and then I have a look at the points got there. So then, second thing then, is I find the price on each supply curve. So I can see here that I've got 8 as being there. I've got 10 being here. So I can see that this distance here, right, between, let's call it point A and point B, this is the vertical distance between the two supply curves. So in this graph, it is A to B. And we can see that in this graph, the distance between A to B is going to be $2. Now, you might say, why has this value of 12 been included? And the answer is that this is our red herring. This is there as a trick because can you see that 12, which is C, is actually not on the supply curves. That point C is actually on the demand curve to fix my B's so that this is actually a trick. So again, if I'm working out the size of a subsidy, I want to know the vertical distance between the supply curves. The way that I like to do it is I pick a quantity, I find the price on each supply curve, and then three is just to calculate the distance. And this is how we work out the size of a subsidy. And just remember that this is $2 per unit. So for each towel that's produced, the government is paying producers $2 per unit. 